The Snapdragon X Elite was the promised messiah. It was going to come and redeem the PC from the Intel and AMD case. Unfortunately, it might be too late to redeem the PC because M4's benchmarks just leaked and already it is the fastest consumer chip on the entire planet. To understand the performance of the M4s, we are going to look at the leaked benchmark scores for this chip. So this is showing the single core CPU performance of 3800 points, which is nearly 22% in performance pump from the M3 and way, way better than the benchmarks we have for the Snapdragon X Elite variants in the single core performance. And if that's not insane already, this is done while using half the power of the M2 chip. What? Honestly, I don't know how any Windows chip is going to recover from this. Now next, we are going to consider the multi-core benchmarks for both the Snapdragon X Elite and the M4. Previously, the Snapdragon X Elite was beating the M3 at least in multi-core benchmarks. But here, we can see that the M4 has now taken the crown from the Snapdragon X Elite with 14,541 points in comparison with the Snapdragon X Elite which is able to score just a little bit lower. Now before we consider the GPU performance, let's consider another metric which is the AI performance. The Snapdragon X Elite is still king when it comes to AI workloads. To put that into context, the Snapdragon X Elite is able to hit 45 trillion operations per second compared to Apple's 38 trillion operations per second. Now, before you get too excited, remember that the X Elite is the best of the best for Qualcomm's. Yet, for Apple, the M4 is the best model. We are yet to see what the M4 Max and other M family chips will bring to the table. Now, lastly, as I said, we are going to consider the GPU performance for these two chips to see who is really leading. So for the GPU, Apple was saying it can deliver up to four times faster GPU performance in comparison with the M2. So the question we have to ask ourselves is, is it too late for the Snapdragon to redeem the PC? For now, it's hard to say, but with only a few weeks remaining for the launch of the AI PC, only time will tell.